everyone, and welcome to McAfee Answers. I'm Stephanie Olkers, and today we'll be showing you how to get the most from your McAfee subscription. This is a great topic because many customers have a McAfee product subscription, but they don't realize that their subscription entitles them to other McAfee benefits as well. If you have a question during the webcast, just click Ask the Question button on the bottom right of the screen, and we'll answer those at the end of the presentation. So here to explain how to get the most from your McAfee subscription is Cheryl from our customer success team. Cheryl has worked in customer success at McAfee for five years, so she has some great information to share with us today. Cheryl? Hello, and welcome to McAfee Answers. Too often in support, I hear from customers who don't fully understand the features provided by their McAfee subscriptions. Most people are aware that a McAfee subscription provides you with the best protection for your devices and online activity. But did you know you get so much more than virus protection when you subscribe? If not, then this edition of McAfee Answers is for you. Today we're answering, how do I get the most from my McAfee subscription? Now, one quick way to see which features are available to you is by opening one of our apps like LiveSafe or Total Protection. In the My Protection menu, you can see my available features such as a VPN, web browser security, identity protection, password manager, parental controls through our Safe Family app, and more. We'll look at some of these in more detail, but first, the first way to maximize your subscription is to use all available licenses. Depending on which package you are subscribed to, you can protect anywhere from a single device to an unlimited number of devices. Don't just install your McAfee software on your main computer. Be sure to use all of your licenses to make sure your phones, tablets, and other computers are protected as well. And if you upgrade your phone or computer, you can easily deactivate the software on your old devices by removing the program. You can protect more devices right from inside our apps, such as LiveSafe or Total Protection. Here's how. Open LiveSafe or Total Protection and click the Protect More Devices tile. From here, you'll see your protected devices on the left side. On the right side, you'll see that you can protect more devices by QR code, email, or text message. To protect a mobile device, such as a new phone, Use your phone's camera to scan the QR code that's shown. You'll be taken to the App Store where you can download the app. Download the app, open it, and follow the prompts to sign in with your McAfee account to get your phone protected. If you'd prefer to use the email or text options, type in an email address that you can open on the device that you want to protect, or type the phone number of the device. Open the email or text on the device and follow the prompts to get that device protected. Another great benefit included in your McAfee subscription is VPN or Virtual Private Network. It is easy to set up and it provides bank grade encryption while you're online. Why do you need one? Well, let's suppose you're out with a friend and you decide to have coffee. The coffee shop has free Wi-Fi, so you connect to it to check your email and maybe pay a few bills at the same time. The problem is most public Wi-Fi networks are unsecure, which means that your financial information, passwords, and more could be exposed to hackers while you're online. To get around this, simply turn on your VPN. Your internet traffic is instantly encrypted and secured, so you can enjoy your coffee without worrying about hackers stealing your data. The McAfee VPN allows you to shop, bank, and browse securely wherever you are. The VPN does this by routing your internet traffic through a special secure tunnel that others can't access. That's how VPN gets its virtual private network name. This traffic is encrypted or scrambled as it passes through the tunnel, making it impossible for anyone to see or read your data. When your scrambled data reaches its destination, the VPN decodes it. Encrypting your internet traffic means that cyber criminals can't steal your passwords, bank and credit card details, or other private data. The VPN also hides your location by changing the IP address of your device, and it can make you seem to be accessing the internet from a completely different country. To start the VPN, open your McAfee app 
such as LiveSafe or Total Protection, and click the Secure VPN tile. You'll see that the VPN is turned off. Before turning it on, choose the virtual location that you want to appear to be accessing the internet from. For example, I'm based in the United States, but I'll change my virtual location to Italy. After choosing my virtual location, the VPN automatically starts and my internet traffic is now secure and private. Our VPN isn't limited to your desktop apps. If you're using the McAfee security app on your iOS or Android device, you can also use the VPN from there. We'll be doing a McAfee Answers session specifically for VPNs soon, so keep an eye on our McAfee Answers KB article to see when that event takes place. If you have children, then be sure you're taking advantage of McAfee's parental controls and get peace of mind knowing your kids are protected online. You can monitor usage, restrict site access, and receive real-time notifications if your child breaks a device rule. The parental controls are provided by McAfee Safe Family which is included with the family premium and ultimate packages at no cost. Having your devices protected is important, but don't forget to protect your personal information as well. Many McAfee subscriptions include identity protection service, so make sure you take advantage of this. McAfee Identity Protection Service monitors up to 10 of your bank accounts, email addresses, and other personal data. You'll receive proactive protection of all your sensitive information and get step-by-step -step guidance when you need it most. Also, when you address any identity breaches, your McAfee protection score increases. If you didn't know, your protection score lets you easily see how well you're protected from online threats. Think of it as a credit score for your online security. The higher the score, the better you're doing. We'll be doing a McAfee Answers session specifically on our protection score soon. So if you want to learn more, keep an eye on our McAfee Answers KB article to see when that event takes place. Another way to protect your personal data is by using password best practices, like making sure the individual password is complex enough by adding symbols, numbers, and a mix of lowercase and capital letters. It is also recommended to use a different password for every website. I know what you're thinking. That is absolutely insane, bonkers, bananas. There is no way I can remember a bunch of different passwords that you just said have to be complex. I can't keep it straight. I completely understand. It sometimes feels impossible. The reason for the recommendation is that many of the breaches that you hear about are caused by bad actors accessing accounts with stolen data. If your email and password combination for one site are stolen, the bad actor can try them in other popular sites. If you use a different email and password combination for each site, you lower your risk of compromising other data. To help keep track of that many passwords, McAfee offers a password manager called TrueKey. With TrueKey Premium that's included with many McAfee subscriptions, you can store an unlimited number of site credentials so that all you have to do is access a, to access a site is push a button. TrueKey can also generate passwords for you, so you don't have to make up every complex password. One thing to note, though, is that the password for TrueKey, called a master password, cannot be retrieved if lost unless you first set up a trusted device that will allow you to reset the password. So make sure that you pick a master password that is complex, but you will be able to remember, and to make sure to trust at least two devices in case you get locked out and need to reset. If one of your supported devices does get a virus, don't panic. Just make use of the Virus Protection Pledge included with your subscription. The Virus Protection Pledge provides you with the confidence that if a supported device gets a virus, a McAfee expert will remove it. If we can't, we will offer a refund for your subscription. If you ever have a problem with your McAfee software, please reach out, but be careful searching Google for help. You might come across third-party tech support companies who claim that they can help you, but they charge a fee for support. 
Never pay for support for your McAfee software. Your subscription includes free technical support, and we are more than happy to help you resolve whatever issue you might have completely free. As you can see, one McAfee subscription protects you, your family, and your devices in many ways. Take care to make use of all of these great features so you can enjoy security at home and on the go across all your compatible devices. Now it's time for more answers, where we're going to answer some more of your questions. Our first question today is, do I need to use auto renewal to get all of these benefits? That's a great question. Most features are available without auto renewal. However, for features like the Virus Protection Pledge and VPN, you'll need to have it on. We recommend that you have it on to ensure that there's never an interruption in your protection. Our next question is, is the free support just a chat service? No, while chatting with support is certainly an option, it isn't the only option. You can choose to call and talk directly with someone about your issue, you can also visit the consumer community to ask questions, share information, and get help from other McAfee customers. Our next question is, how do I get technical support from McAfee? And that's another great question. We have an extensive knowledge base at service.macfee.com that provides answers to many of the questions that you might have with your McAfee products. If you don't see what you want in the knowledge base and you'd like to connect with an agent instead, just go to service.mcafee.com slash contact to get started. Technical support is also available through our official Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube support channels. We'll include links to all of these in the recording of the webinar. Our final question, is how do I know which subscription is best for me? This might vary from customer to customer. So what I recommend is that you go to our website at mcafee.com and review the products and features to see which suits you best. If you don't find it there, our support agents are ready to help at service.mcafee.com slash contact. Well, that's all the time we have for this episode of McAfee Answers. Thanks so much for joining us and we'll see you next time.